A huge advantage of going to the gym and taking care of our physique is the fact that it leads to many positive habits. Out of necessity, we start paying more attention to what ends up on our plate and we make sure to get enough sleep. All while avoiding stimulants, we do everything we can to maintain perfect health for many years. But what if suddenly it turned out that, despite exemplary discipline, we're still not taking care of our longevity even half as much as it is possible? The cause of such dilemma will be a guy named Brian Johnson. He's a billionaire who developed the Blueprint Project. It consists of rigorously taking care of the functioning of own body and scrupulously monitoring its parameters. The 46-year-old's goal is maximum possible inhibition of the aging process. For this purpose, he has adequately optimized every area of life one could think of, literally. For example, he is currently focused on improving the quality of his erection during sleep. For that purpose, he owns a special device that monitors such characteristics as hardness and duration. His target are the parameters of an average 18-year-old. Despite it all, this material should only be treated as an interesting bit of trivia. Using his methods, which I will present in a moment, will be unrealistic. One of the reasons are financial resources. The star of this episode has sold his company in 2013 for a whole $800 million. Despite him eating only 2,250 calories, diet and supplementation alone cost him a few hundred dollars a day. Add to that the cost of numerous expensive medical equipment. Brian has his own home clinic to monitor the parameters of his own body and perform different types of treatments. Then there's also the issue of time limitations. The billionaire devotes his whole day to sticking to a rigorous schedule. Most of us, on the other hand, in our pursuit of keeping up with all our duties, dream of a day that has more than 24 hours. Maybe someone may have tried the optimal morning routine suggested by Andrew Huberman. Around 15 minutes of being exposed to sun right after waking up, a cold shower, meditation, workout, and then we can finally allow ourselves the first sip of coffee. Of course, the practices suggested by him do have a positive impact on health. The thing is, not many people can afford such a long morning ritual while at the same time trying to get enough sleep and make it to work on time in the morning. On top of that, such drastic change of habits would cause us to give up after two days. Brian starts his day with taking a whole handful of different supplements. In total, he takes more than 100 pills throughout the day. When we watch the vlogs of professional bodybuilders, we may be surprised by the amounts of supplements they take. In one of his materials, Nick Walker has shown a whole cabinet of different packages. However, when compared to the millionaire in question, one could call him an amateur. That's because he has a special room with a huge closet devoted solely to boxes full of supplements. Most of us only take a few of them. That's why Brian has a special team of people who sort his pills on a daily basis. They are also busy with analyzing scientific studies, and if they decide that some supplement will be beneficial, they add it to the protocol. If we wanted to discuss them all, it would take a few hours worth of material. So let's move on to the diet. Now that we know this person a bit, we can assume that it will also be prepared with lab-grade precision. It's a vegan diet with caloric deficit. Obviously, he's not getting prepared to enter the bodybuilding scene. What matters is that maintaining a negative energy balance, according to numerous scientific studies, can potentially make life longer. This may arise from slowing down the metabolism and reducing inflammations. Brian eats pretty much the same thing every day, although it is a pretty nutritious diet that consists of top quality products. Some of them are eaten by most of us every day, such as broccoli, cauliflower, or sweet potatoes. His diet also consists of more sophisticated products such as black lentils, Asian hen of the woods mushrooms, or pomegranate juice. Some of the products are outside our budget. These include macadamia milk, the price of which reaches $100 per gallon. He has mentioned on his website that one day of eating, not including supplements, cost him nearly $50, which means that the monthly cost of such diet can reach as much as $1,500. And let me remind you that the billionaire eats a little above 2,000 calories. If somebody wanted to build muscle mass with this kind of menu, I think they would have to take out a bank loan. Either way, Brian has achieved a great physique while on this diet. These may not be bodybuilding standards, but he looks better than most guys at any beach. 
He has quite a lot of muscle mass, but above all else, he is very low fat. On his website, he mentions that his body fat level is only 7%. He also works on his composition during workouts. He works out every day for about an hour. He performs both strength and endurance workouts as he wishes to maintain the best possible condition of his circulatory system. He monitors it using the VO2 max index, which determines the maximum amount of oxygen that the body can use during exertion. Brian's results are downright excellent, even for the standards of an 18-year-old. His strength workouts, on the other hand, differs a little from the typical regimen that we can see every day. It is mainly focused on pretty specific exercises that take a huge part of his workout. These exercises include workout of tibialis muscles, as well as muscles responsible for the posture, such as levator scapulae muscles. Pull-ups, squats, or other multi-joint movements take a small percentage of his plan. He intertwines it all with stretches, and at the end, he focuses on abdominal muscles. The general structure of the millionaire's workout is pretty weird. He performs a lot of different exercises, in one series only and with small weights. On the other hand, he doesn't care about hypertrophy, but above all else, on a healthy locomotor system. His schedule doesn't include, on the other hand, the incredibly important hip hinge motion or the overhead press. Even so, he was able to develop decent strength results. As he claims, he was able to press 240 pounds on the bench. On the leg press equipment, on the other hand, he has pressed 790. Although there's nothing indicating that Brian isn't actually a natural, he uses a testosterone replacement therapy in form of patches. The constant caloric deficit causes a decrease of this hormone. In an attempt to counteract that, the millionaire went for TRT, which allowed to elevate the level of his testosterone to the upper bracket of normal. On top of that, he has used the growth hormone. However, after just three months, he quit it as he was experiencing side effects. In his big yet very tidy home, Johnson keeps a lot of different types of medical equipment. Local clinics would get jealous. Besides numerous exams, Brian also undergoes laser skin treatment among others. Most viewers have certainly noticed his downright too perfect appearance. He doesn't have any imperfection on his face, which is a result of undergoing numerous treatments. He also owns a device that analyzes skin damage caused by UV radiation, conducts hearing tests, and even performs ultrasounds to evaluate the structure of internal organs. Brian is also a real master of regeneration. He utilizes all the known recommendations on proper sleep hygiene, such as limiting the exposure to blue light, sleeping in a fully darkened and silenced room, or going to sleep at the same time every day. But thanks to his fortune, he was able to take it to the next level. He owns a special mattress with a temperature adjustment feature, which adjusts it based on the sleep phase. He also uses a special device that stimulates the vagus nerve, which allows him to calm down and reduce stress. As a result, Brian has textbook sleep parameters. As he says, he is able to fall asleep in just four minutes. Besides the fixed routine, it is also thanks to reducing stress to the minimum. Back when he was still a businessman, it cost him a lot of health, nerves, and sleepless nights. Taking on the Blueprint Project was also a way to go on a relaxed retirement. Its foundation is measuring all the possible body parameters. All of his markers are perfect. For that reason, Brian is described as the most tested person in the world. One could only dream of the health services being willing to test their patients this scrupulously. Thanks to the rigorous lifestyle, the millionaire was able to slow down the aging process by 31 years. In theory, this means that he is aging at the pace of an average teenager. Nevertheless, that doesn't mean that Brian has moved back in time. He had functioned just like each of us until he started his project. Due to scrupulously researching and publishing his body's parameters, he will certainly contribute to the progress of science with that. Personally, I am curious about the effects of this experiment. However, we will still have to wait a few decades for the results, assuming that Brian doesn't die prematurely, like due to an accident, for example. In such case, the whole project would go to waste because its main goal is to verify how much such rigorous lifestyle translates to longevity. I can imagine that thanks to it, Johnson will live at least to 100. Otherwise, it would mean that natural death is a result of something other than perfect functioning of the body. Either way, his project takes a whole lot of discipline. Brian will be subjected to a rigorous routine for the rest of his life. In fact, each everyday activity, like working out for example, has become a chore to him 
and let's just imagine that we would never again be able to spoil ourselves with an occasional fast food meal or a party with friends. Although, as the millionaire himself admits, he enjoys this scientifically optimal lifestyle. 